Hey, this is Ruben Wolf Gaming, and welcome back to Symphony of War. Now, I think the last video was like almost an hour and a half long, so <laughs> I have uh, these arena. What's it called? Um, these arena things in here. So I'm wondering if I should just make them as a separate video, and then their own their own chapters and like organizing, and then people could just skip on to the story, you know. So I, I think I'll do that. So I needed this like, how would I explain it? Um, pre, pre deploy uh, stuffs, right? I'll make it its own video, and then if you want to move on to the story, then we can just go on to. Uh, uh, you can just move on to the next video. So I think I'll do that. We have some arena tokens. I bought one from the marketplace. Um, yeah, we purchased it here at the bottom. It was kind of like 1,500 gold, I want to say. There's a lot of cool stuff in here, but... There's even cooler stuff in the Recruit tab. We have a Ice Mage here, I think. Yeah, that's an Ice Mage. And we have another uh, Valkyrie, which we definitely want, for sure. Klaus is another Scout that we can throw into a unit. But that unit with the Scouts already in there kind of needs a healer. Like, at least one, right, to keep them topped off. Um, so buying him is not really priority. We also have, uh, this other swordsman, level 19 swords rider. Um, probably slightly better. They're also a soldier captain, right, and they're 40 leadership. So if we look at them, uh, heavy tree units in the squad cost two less capacity. Which is good, um, if you want to sit her in the back line with, you know, leaders, or more heavy guys in the back. But, I'm not that impressed. Right, but I just want these two. Um, and then... We have another Cloak of Cunning here. Greatly reduced chance to be critically hit. That's okay. Excalibur is kind of meh, right? It has strength, it gives magic, it gives armor. It's good to put on our Wolfie squad. The, uh, the protagonist squad. More horses, we can always use more. We, we seem to run out of a lot of them. Healing Attuned. We have that on Diana. I don't think we need any more of these. Uh, I'm gonna grab this Apple of Agility real quick. Warrior's Hubris. Uh, unit gains resistance to magical magician and damage attacks with strength increases. Um, really good to put on one of our frontliners. Uh, we might buy that. You know, just to fight dragons and magicians. You know, anti-magician our guys up. We want this Keshi uh, Daikatana. That's really good. Iron. Another Bowmanship. Any archery attacks from this unit will ignore the penalty for firing uh, at walls or woods, so we'll go grab that too. There's not much else we'd really grab. I mean, we can grab this to replace um, that item. Might as well grab that. Um, and this doesn't. If, this is kind of like a meh item, right? Uh, once we do the the arena, we'll grab these guys. So we'll do that now after we do sports. We have more conversations. <laughs> so Rascuja has more stuff to talk about, right? We're gonna learn more about his legends of the Baraktor, his kitty cat people, the Khajiit. Greetings, human. First things first, please call me Wolfie. Deal? Yes, Wolfie, Ruskujo will comply. So I've heard so much about this Eskander fella. You know, these, even though they, they speak with like an accent or like, uh, what's it called? Um, broken, like, whatever common language that these people have, he's very polite, and I like that. <laughs> so, uh, some sort of legendary Brechtor. What's the deal with him, anyway? You would think he was some sort of god. Eskander was a fierce and powerful warrior 100 years ago, during time of great crisis. Humans sought to conquer Baraktor and destroy Baraktor's spirit. The, the great Eskander rallied people together and defeated much more powerful enemies to earn Baraktor freedom. Eskander so great, he led Baraktor lands to seek out and to destroy his enemy where they hide. A return home loved by all. 
Iskander become a great chieftain about all Baraktur people and, repo and repopulate her kind. Oh wow. So all the female cats wanted a piece of him, right? Most Baraktur are somehow related to Iskander this day. I hope so is with Skujo, so have his great and divine warrior blood. <laughs> you know, supposedly, um, what was his name? Uh, Genghis Khan, right? A lot of people related to him. He conquered a lot of people. I mean, his his stories is not as, as cool as Iskander's. I mean, it is in our world, right? But, you know, there's controversy around it, but this is a, a fantasy character who has, like, a cool legendary background. I wonder why I'd never learned much about him. Huh. Baraktor lifespan not as long as human. So, I mean, they're cat people, right? Maybe because of their metabolism is so fast. That's why I can, like, really be a murdering death cat machine, right? <laughs> like, uh, if you... You know anything about, like, uh, rodents. Their, their hearts beat so fast and so long. You know, like, for... To get the metabolism up high, they have to eat so much fru food, like shrews and uh, field mice and things like that. They have like a lifespan of like seven to ten years or so, give or take. Iskander, pa Iskander passed next life after reaching golden age of 50 years. So a human will live a hundred. These uh, Baraktor only live to 50. That's sad. Iskander's policy on human is to be big being friendly because a best friend named Lucian Ibilis, who was a prominent human and great hero of human lands. Yep, everyone knows about Lucian uh, Ibilis. Because of their friendship, human and Baraktor were to be connected. Lucian lived on many years past Iskander, but without a great hero, Lucian and Baraktor people were to be to being disconnected slowly over time. Hmm. Solution didn't stay connected to the Baraktor. That's sad. But I guess, like, he's human, so he wants to be with his own people, too. Lucian attempted to befriend new Baraktor chieftains, but it was not to be being. Um, he tried, right? New Baraktor chieftains didn't respect Lucian. Over the next 50 years, Baraktor attempted to return to Old Way. No longer trade food with humans or Sayuna in exchange for the great treasures. Baraktor society become poor. <laughs> now we <laughs> attempt to repair damage, but without being weak to conquest, much like during the time of Iskandar. I could listen to this stuff all day, cat. I mean, hey, you gotta call him Brektor. Don't just call him cat. I mean, he is a cat person, cat man. It does great honor to Skuja when humans show interest in Brektor. <laughs> Mofi is good companion for Skuja, but Skuja wishes to talk more in future days. Count on it. Yeah. I love Rescuja here, man. Come on. How could you not love Rescuja? Death Panther? Come on. Subtlety is a lost art. Oh, these two again. Hello again, Diana. Snuck up on me there. How long have you been there? Ah, is that for me? Me like eat. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 uh, Vaidonar, you're, you're too kind to me. You don't have to keep this up. But my muscles do appreciate it. Yes, big. I mean, sure, I'm sure they... Yep, thought so. I think he, she mentioned her, her, her bus size to him. And that, um, it's just, no, I don't mean to, it's just who you are, and you're a, a mis just a mystery to me. Mm, I suppose for your sake, I'll have to convince myself that it is my... Mysterious personality that has you fixated. I mean, this is all personality right here, right? Hey, look up at her face. Her face is quite pretty, too, right? And her figure? Come on. But she does have a interesting mind. Uh, hell yeah. Uh, yeah, I shall not hide for the rest of my life. Good day. Man, it's not being a pussy. I mean, she is quite intimidating, but if she ever met her in real life and she's like, that Amazonian beautiful in front of you? God. Wolf and Sander, shock and awe. Let's talk some strategy, huh? Lysander, it seems like war has evolved. You certainly know how to whet my curiosity. It's not a gentleman's game anymore. The succession war and this one are turning all levels of society into engines of war. 
No one has spared its horror and its draining effect. Indeed. That's why we must strike decisively and achieve total victory. The worst possible outcome is a stalemate, just like what led to what led to disaster in the Succession War. This is why I have focused so much of my energies on the development of gunnery tactics. Because I believe these weapons can be used to terrify an enemy into submission before clueless politicians get the idea to send waves of young men to their deaths. I see what you mean, logically speaking. If one could equip an entire army with guns, it would render everything else useless. Until the other enemy also equipped their, their men with guns, and then you have a World War I stalemate. Yeah, I mean, I don't think you, you you thought that far ahead, but for a little while, you may have the advantage. Perhaps. But for the time being, it is rather fortunate that the pyrocyte needed to make them is so limited. Till such time as we somehow develop a, strong, a defense against gunnery, the force that controls the pyrocyte will always have the edge. It seems the only good defense against firearms is avoiding their gunshot, their shots, striking quickly and decisively before they have a chance to fire back. Very good thinking, Wolfie. You can wait for weather to change. As firearms are useless in the rain. I mean, the weather is not exactly anybody's friend. Of course, you can produce similar firepower with mature battle mages or dragons, but those will be much more expensive and difficult to acquire. I mean, yeah, we only have one unit of dragons. Like, Okay, so we got arenas here. We're gonna go ahead and do them. And of course, we can only bring five units, right? Um, so let's go ahead and bring Lysander's unit. Why not? Um, Abigail's. Can you keep level on for those dragons? I'd love to bring Barnabas. Diana's squad is almost fully upgraded, so maybe not. Sybil's squad is pretty fun to bring out. Uh, let's go with uh, Rascuja and Narima. Um, you know, I may do something with this squad, you know, bring out, maybe I like a heavy guy in front, but, um, yeah, Rescuja is fine. And then we got, oh, that was only four. You can bring out, um, let's see, Stefan, I guess? Yeah, why not? It's not the toughest unit, but it'll be alright. For like a bronze mission. I await your command. I can do this. Rascuja is to be ready. Oh, sorry. Did you need something? My turn right here. Yeah, that's fine. I kind of want to hit this unit first, but I'm not sure. We can actually do that. Yeah, that horse kind of got in the way. We're already in inside their range. They have like an attack range of two. Um, not, not having cavalry actually hurts us a bit. Because they'll mess up like one of our units. So we're we'll sending Rescujo to the front line. He may be able to dodge some of it. Yeah. The rest of these guys are pretty fucked, though. So him being in the woods is pretty good. Will never die. We'll use these woods as our, our cover. I must be brave. And... I'll try to take out this, this infantry squad here. Yeah, the dragons actually didn't do that good in comparison. Got the back line now. Break their resolve. Um, we'll just leave Bet them you be. Didn't see this one coming. Yeah. I love this. Try part. to beat them away from my skirmishers here. The army is ready. That should be okay. Okay, you're attacking us in the woods. I'm okay with that. Just take your guys yourself out. 
I leveled up for it. That's good. Oh, they can skirmish with us too, so we might not be able to go back. Oh, okay, cool. Awesome. Quite happy with that. Oh, free action, yeah. Nice. Take like zero damage too. After the healing. Oof. Uh no. We survive. And we actually took out one of their cannons. Luckily, we're in the woods, so I think the damage is lessened. Nice, nice. They decided to get into melee with us, which is a mistake, I think. <laughs> You're in his jungle now. Just two of these guys were uh, were archers, huh? In a sense, level three ones, but so they did quite a lot of damage. We forgot to upgrade this guy. That's actually a bit of a mistake because he can't get his uh, class mastery up. But I kind of wanted to rush through these arenas since the only thing we're looking for is the. Uh, I mean, yeah, we want the XP from it. That, that definitely helps. But um. Let's see. Um, aggressive on these guys. We need them out. But what we want is the gold and the items. Especially those uh, class point stuff. Actually, it'd be better to attack them from the woods. Uh, just a regular attack this way. Didn't do anything crazy. Just took out the whole front row with this guy. This is great. I might just want to throw one of those in every every skirmisher unit. That'd be pretty sweet. Battle formations. Uh, let's see. Aggressive. Nah. What's our next tactic? Let's go attack this guy. Aggressively target these guys. <laughs> Kaboom! <laughs> Yes. <laughs> this is so good. Great to soften up any unit. And my friends are counting on me. I guess we'll do something like that. Force surrender. There should be one guy in there. Okay. We'll heal up. Why not? And that's everybody. Is to be ready. Let's see. Let's go aggressive on this guy. And go for our squishies back there. It would be good to replace this mage with one of our own, like the new guy. If Rescuja can fit him anyway. I can do this. Alright, just heal yourself. Why not? Donar, guide my attack. Bet you didn't see this. Some healer one. XP, and yeah, we'll be done with that. I need to attack first, but we'll finish it. There you go. Class Mastery up. I think they'll be able to get to... I don't know if that's a tier 1 unit or not, to be perfectly honest. Our Scooch unit only has 6. I kind of want to add more units into his squad. Even like Nurima's. But Nurima can't get there in time, so... Let's get him more loyalty. Yeah.
and uh, leadership points. Got S rank. We got all three codexes and, and uh, a blade master's armor. Zero point blade and beef of might. I really like that item. So yeah. Let's organize our army real quick because I don't want to forget to upgrade uh, some of these guys before I bring them out to fight. So change class. This guy can either be a ranger or an assassin. He's part of this squad. So I'd actually want another assassin, I think. These guys are kind of fun. Um, yeah. Let's use an item on this guy. See if we can... If we use three codexes on him, we can get him to maybe Swordmaster level. At least figure out how much XP he needs. Okay. So if we try to change his class to a Swordsmaster, or her, anyway, we need 60, uh, <laughs> 60 skill, right? Um, that's a lot, so. Well, what we can do is XP Codex them a couple times. Uh, okay, just the one time. Give them Apple Agility. So I'll bump them up a little bit and be on their way to get that. Um, let's see. Warrior Smite, what's that do? Unit does 50% more damage to rogues, assassins, and magician units. Wow. That's actually really good. Do you really help to one-shot those guys? Um, I wouldn't use the item on them, but imposing. These units are more likely to be targeted by enemies in battle. You have this other scavenger thing. Uh, yeah. I mean, like her unit's good at like killing people. If they can kill that mage by themselves. Well, I might as well give them that, right? The Mint of Magic, we'll give to somebody else. Um, now the other unit, right? It'll be leveled up to just Kujas. Um, yeah, change class. We want to make him into... I'm not sure why we have him in this unit. <laughs> Uh, that is a good question. So, if you remove him real quick... Yeah, he'll have... Enough to fit that, that mage or something, you know? Uh, marketplace. Recruit. Yeah, let's give him a nice mage. Why not, you know? <laughs> uh, let's see. Organize army. Squad ops. Or Scooge's unit. Um, two mages, even, you know? Add a unit, give him another Ice Mage, just cuz, and then uh, move them around a little bit. We need to keep those guys on the side, so do something like a little like that. No, oh, hold on. Uh, switch places. You go to the middle. There we go. Perfect. Now, I would want a better front line than uh, this ranger, but I can't fit any more units into it. So what I'll do is I'll use this uh, Medal of Valor, right, to give him more uh, points to work with. So once he gets up to, say, 70, 71, or 72, we can add another guy into this unit. And then we can think about putting like a, a better guy and move this guy in the back somewhere. The Scooja is just so tanky and dodgy that I'm not worried about it. But yeah, his, his unit is actually pretty strong though. Um, I'm happy with that. Yeah. Actually, hold on. I, I may not be happy with that. Would It makes him an infantry unit, not light, yeah, light infantry. So there's a bit of an issue. So we'll have to remove this guy, right? Now he's back to a light infantry unit. We have to add another swordsman or like a rogue type. So these guys actually okay. Um, change class. What can these guys be changed to? You can change them into a rogue, right? 
and they can become either an assassin or a ranger. Um, make them into a skirmisher. And these guys can be turned into Zwayhanders. So, I think I like that, right? Um, squad Ops. I mean, the problem with that is, is that that still makes them kind of yeah, it'd be like even, so three and three. So we have to sacrifice um, at some point in time. We need to be able to add one more skirmisher in here uh, later on, but for for the time being, I think it's okay. So we'll add him back into the unit. That's okay. So we'll do something like that, and that skirmisher will turn into a Zweihander litter. Um, may have to add another skirmisher later, or buy one. Yeah, something like that. Slowly level them over time, it's fine. Even Roberto's a squad, if we keep using them, maybe their skirmisher unit will upgrade over time. Um, but yeah. Hmm. Which leaves these two kind of hanging. It's a little sad. Uh, hmm. I like Narimba's squad the way it is. Gunther's squad is kind of skirmisher heavy. We could give them like a mage to kind of hit harder. Though the Gunther squad can hit twice instead of a mage only hitting once. So it might be fine though it is. Hmm. Jules' squad needs another healer. So can I do something with that? Um, squad operator, no, change class. We turn you, oh, they get turned from a fighter. That's interesting. Yeah. Interesting. I guess if I want another healer, I have to buy one. Um, hmm. I mean, it'd be worth... Uh, if I wanted like, a healer that's really good for uh, Tristan's squad, I put a Valkyrie in this unit. So that's what we'll do. We'll buy that Valkyrie and put in Tristan's unit. It'd be fun to put six Valkyries in this unit. <laughs> but I don't think we could fit them. Well, maybe. Maybe. Okay, that's what we'll do. Anyway, let's go back to the arena. So yeah, this is a silver one, so we may want some, uh... What's it called? Uh, different units. We'll still bring Rascuja. We're bringing, uh... Norima. We're trying to level up these skirmishers. Sybil's unit, I like Sybil's unit, but it's already pretty maxed out, aside from the mage, and maybe that's where we'll put the, the extra mage, maybe he's better mage. Uh, Lysander's unit, um, I'm not sure they upgraded to anything else in particular. These guys do need to be leveled up though, into like these sentinels, so I'm gonna keep bringing them. Um, Wolfie's squad is pretty leveled, I don't need to bring them anymore. Diana's unit, super leveled. Um, Stefan, we still got a couple of, like, loose strings, like, like weaker guys, right? We want to upgrade them to something else. So continue bringing Stefan. And maybe we do need a cab guy who can handle the heat. Hmm. Send Barnabas, why not? And then, ro uh, yeah, I'm happy with that begin mission. Okay. Swift as wind, strike like fire. Mr. Gucci, you can go this way. And then, Sayuna will never die. have our skirmishers wait in the woods. Break their resolve. I think he can ambush, so it'd be I fine. I love this part. 
Sit on the hill. School is and Bartabas to sit there. Let them come across the bridge. If they're shooting at us with archers, then that's not gonna do anything. <laughs> Rogues? What are those against cavalry with armor? Man, you guys didn't kill him? What? That's not bullshit. Take out the healer, that's a good choice. God damn! Loyalty up. So this squad would be able to fit more people in there because of that. That's pretty good. Um, let's see. I was hoping to sneak Rascuja around, but... Uh, Stefan. Getting real thirsty here. We'll do something like this. Um, force surrender. Yeah. Then we'll be able to attack the guy in the back. We'll go aggressive. Now it might have been a better choice to attack with Stefan instead. Because we can get all these guys in the back, we might be able to one-shot the unit. But these guys would have had a chance to hit our our front line, which wouldn't have been bad or anything. The swordsman could have done it. What we can do is back up here, maybe not too far. I'll just back right there, and then uh, let's see, Rescuja, you can sit in the front line, force the surrender. Yep. Time to even the odds. The army is ready. I was hoping we could fit them through here, but I guess Bruna, not. Guide my yeah, I should have did that in a different order. So uh, Bartimus can sneak in here too. But that's okay. Though it might have been because like these um, these guys were blocking Battle us from going forward. So actually, yeah. We don't want those dragons to, uh, <laughs> to attack us. So let's take them out. With guns and firepower. <laughs> oh shit! They, they hit our uh, our cannon there. Ooh, that hurts actually. Ooh, that's not good. Yeah, his squad is not very good for the front lines. It's because like our our tier two units are not very good at the front. These guys are like, gla they are glass cannons. It's nothing you can really do about it. It's probably like the worst unit we could have fought. I'll have to keep that in mind. Now well, they get XP, it's okay. These are not like our, uh, our tier one units, or not tier one, but like our um, our best squads for the job. Oh, sorry. Though Did you need something? the problem with us losing that squad right there is that we don't get an S, which kind of sucks. I'm okay with it though. This is just for like extras. This unit should be able to take out the whole archer unit. In the next round at least. Yeah. They're not gonna be any annoying anymore. Nice. Swift as wind. I need you to take out this unit. 
Actually, yeah, Barnabas can handle the other guys. <laughs> Mage didn't have any chance. I await your command. Uh, aggressive. We're trying to level up this squad so we can at least fit one more person in here. Give them more attack power. Class mastery up. Okay. Might be able to get them a uh, proof of merit. Actually, what I'm gonna do, since these are shattered, I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna walk them forward. So maybe these guys will hit themselves on us. They do get the first attack advantage, but I'm not worried about it. Not with his squad. Maybe we gotta get a little bit more cash. More more leadership. Um Oof, that was actually pretty bad. We lost our mage. Class mastery up, okay. That's pretty good. Okay. School is in session. Now we could keep whack wailing on them, which we could do. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna move out of the way. And then send Rascuja in here. And we go aggressive. We're not too afraid. Yeah, I'm perfect. I'm glad I put that mage in this unit. Yeah. Sayuna will never. Sayuna can capture this. There you go. Perfect. Well, not perfect. We lost the squad because I sent the the gunners to fight the wrong enemy. <laughs> The sapphire ring, and that's I think that might be magic related, but I'm not sure. Blue for magic, green for stealth, skill, and then uh, red for attack power. But yeah, that's uh, how far did we record for? 37 minutes, so yeah, we'll call this the well, we'll continue for now if you want to watch me organize the army and all that, you know. And then the next episode will make it the actual um, deploy button. Um, but yeah, if you <laughs> we're grabbing this guy, right? The Valkyrie. Um, maybe even grab this guy. I don't know. Hmm. Let's just grab him. Why not? Treat healing attuned. Infinity water. I don't even want any of this. We'll save the rest for, for any cash extra. Um, let's see. Organized army, right? Is that what's going on? And, oh yeah, the Rimba squad. Um, use item. We got, you can give her a proof of merit, right? So now that she's a blade master that's at max CP, she now has a golden sword. <laughs> With like some golden... I don't know what to call that, like a golden shirt and a bow. Morning, class can now be changed, yes. Like, bring her up to 82 strength, 83 skill, more weapon damage. Like, please, thank you. And, uh, yeah. She's now just a powerful unit. We maybe fit a unit in here somewhere. Um. Yeah. Let's see, move him, I don't know, back here. Something like that. And then let's add another unit. Ah, we can't add him. Dang. We need to get rid of like one item. Let's look at the artifacts real quick. Evasion, skill, like plus 15 skill, that's a lot. And then more evasion. 
I'm not sure that's worth it. But we'll never be able to um, add people in here if we don't do that. Um, just more damage, right? You can. The whole point of not getting. Like, having more damage over evasion, you want to kill them before they can hit you. So that might be better, right? So this is plus 8 skill and 7. So let's remove this, right? Yeah, I think I'm happy with that. We might be able to fit one guy. <laughs> Can we fit? Please, ah, uh, one guy, just one guy. Ugh, damn. This hurts a little bit. It's gonna keep removing equipment. Um, squad ops, Marima. Do those things not like add? Hold on. Was I not reading him correctly? Um, is it because we have the negative one capacity on items? Is that is that why? Yeah, it doesn't cost any capacity. Wow, okay. So where's the other item we just took off? The Mikashi Dai Katana? Yeah, it's zero capacity. This bow though... <laughs> oh man, that sucks to do. Because it's like actually some of our damage and our ability to dodge and things like that. So now we're at 12. We can add in... Um, we can't actually. It's 12 plus 2 because of mercenary. So that's like 14. But it says 12 capacity, so I'm not sure why. Um, maybe we can use an item here. No. I was hoping to give her like a an XP codex or something to level up. Um, yeah, we just have to. Sucks to suck, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> for us. Let's give Rebecca an item. What's this? Uh, do we get anything new? Got the refuge and the... Oh yeah, 20% healing power. Uh, Blade Master's armor. 25% damage taken from swords. We get more HP and strength. Uh, might as well equip him, right? Somebody. Um... I mean, it just makes sense to put it on her, right? <laughs> nah. The true shot bow, while good, is not as cool as that. Uh, okay. Squad ops. I was talking about Tristan's squad before, but Diana is moving these units around a tiny bit. Let's do something like that. And then, can we add another Valkyrie? We can't. But can we remove some artifacts to get that thing in there? That's plus one capacity. These are zero capacity, so I don't think it would matter. Because this is like 10, we need 12. Or 14. So, um, Dino Squad. Move units. We're just gonna have to be happy, you know? I kind of want to be able to see Diana. So I'm just gonna do something like that. Um, yeah. Abigail's units, fine. Who can we throw this Valkyrie into? I mean, Barnabas' squad could use a new Valkyrie unit, so... And then add unit, uh, Valkyrie. Yep, this one. Yeah. Because that, that healer was kind of vulnerable to get, to dying. Let's not have that. <laughs> I don't like that. Uh, Tristan's squad. Um, hmm. He already has Denari and Imperial Battle Armor, right? We can't even do more with that. Um, 
But we'll add the healer unit in here. I'll move uh, the leader. Um, something like that, I guess. The problem is, is like the leader should probably stay in the back. That's better. Because if he, as long as he survives, he gets more XP. There are rogues and everything like that, but I'm not worried about it. Uh, let's see. How's Jules' unit doing? That's fine. Benny? Your squad get any better? Not really. Sybil? How's your squad doing? You can probably add another artifact. Okay. Why did we give you the true shot bow? Oh yeah, because of the Master Swordsman. Okay. Um, what do we got? Sapphire Ring, plus three magic, zero capacity, that's good. Keshi Daikatana, more evasion, less HP. It's not bad. A zero point blade, more HP, more, more armor, uh, negative two strength though. Hmm. Refuge, 20 healing power in combat. Um, hmm. I also got the cloak of hunting. Yeah, let's, uh, we can't equip it. <laughs> Just one off, alright? So let's give them something that's only one or. Let's give him a Kashi Kitai Katana, so another full. Um, uh, this is Benny's squad. They don't have a true, like the uh, true shot bow. We have an extra here. This is Gunther's squad. Um, Imperial battle armor. Rescuja squad doesn't need the Imperial battle armor, I think. So we'll remove that. And try to equip them with something else. Which, uh, I like the Cloak of Cunning. We might give that to them. Um... Yeah. Oh, can't give it to them. <laughs> Over the cap limit. Um... Might as well keep it on them, I guess. Because it brings us down to 60 immediately. That's, uh, that's a little weird. Um, hmm. Throwaway squad. You guys got a bunch of cool shit on you guys. This squad, Wolfie squad, can actually add a second guy in here. Or another guy, right? So why not? Another mage? <laughs> More mages? I mean, uh... I would like another front line for them. That'd be kind of good. Having like a third, um, or another one of these guys, right? But, hmm. We'll just have the mage, fuck it. Well, something like that. And, uh, yeah, I mean. <laughs> I would love to give them the Excalibur, but can we change out this Accolades Mace for something? Can we give them, oh wait, the ring, right? The blue ring? Yeah, there we go. Just a little extra magic. This whole squad's full of mages. So we have a, one of these guys. We make just a new squad. Let me check their status real quick. Level third, like 38, 40. Um, yeah, I might as well make another squad. Form new squad. This guy, we're gonna change his class. We don't want him in here. 
Uh, another skirmisher, why not? And then change your class to another skirmisher. Not the not the best, not the worst. So I'm gonna save here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So until we deploy to uh, <laughs> defend the the castle we just took, right? I'll see you guys later. Bye.